Imagine turning $1,000 into $10,000. Sounds impossible, right? Wrong. In this video, we're going to talk about Options Unleashed, and we're going to reveal the secrets that Wall Street doesn't want you to know. In the next few minutes, you'll discover how everyday traders are utilizing the leverage and power of options to multiply their profits. And I'm not talking about any risky bets or get rich quick schemes. These traders are utilizing real option tools and following specific rules and strategies in order to change their trading game and the way that they grow their accounts. Whether you're a seasoned trader or just starting out, get ready to unlock the power of options and leverage. We're going to cover not only you know the puts and the calls, but more advanced strategies, and you're going to be able to multiply your profits. But here's the kicker. We're going to show you how to do this and manage risk at the same time. So you're not going to have to bet the farm in order to make big profits. So are you ready to unleash the power of options? Before we get started, be sure and hit the like and subscribe button down below. Also, download the free options workshop in the link below. It talks about the two main benefits of trading options over buying stocks outright. Welcome to the heart of option trading and the incredible power of utilizing leverage. This is where the magic happens. Imagine controlling $10,000 worth of stock with just $500. Well, you can do it. Here's how it works. Instead of buying 100 shares of a $100 stock or $10,000, you can buy a call option for probably $500 and control that same 100 shares. That's a 20 to one leverage ratio. So your $500 is doing the work of a $10,000 investment. If that $10,000 investment in the stock moves up 10%, if you own the stock, it would be worth $11,000. So your profit would be $1,000, right? So that would be a 10% gain, which isn't too shabby. However, if you have the option contract and the stock price moves up 10%, well, your $500 is now worth $1,500 or $2,000. So we're talking a 200, 300% gain. Now with this power comes the responsibility. If the stock price moves against you, you could lose your entire $500. However, you can't lose more than you put in when you're buying an option. The max you can lose is the amount you paid for the option. Now, if you own the stock and the stock price goes down, you could potentially lose a lot more. This is why options are so powerful. They allow traders with smaller accounts to punch above their weight class and grow an account from a small account to a much bigger account. Now that we understand the power of utilizing leverage and options, let's talk about some different strategies. The first one is the classic long call strategy, and it involves buying a call option. Now the beauty of this trade is there is unlimited upside potential and limited risk since your max loss is the amount that you paid for the call option. Your profits could be at you know, 200, 300%, depending on how far the stock price moves. Okay guys, let's look at how we buy a long call option. And we're gonna punch in DKNG for DraftKings on the Tasty Trade platform. There's a link down below. I use Tasty Trade and Mumu. We're gonna go to, uh, we're gonna be on the table mode right here and then also trade tab right here. And we're gonna open up 34 days to expiration. I like to go in between 30 and 45 days to expiration. We're gonna click right here to open it up. And this opens up the option chain. And you can see puts on the right, calls on the left. The stock DraftKings is trading at $38 right now. Now, so here is where the $38, $38.43. Now what, what we are looking to do is buy an option. So we can either buy, we wanna buy near the money. And uh, again, we're out 34 days. We can either buy the 38 in the money for $3.10 or the 260 just out of the money. And we're hoping that the, bet, that the stock price moves up. So let's look at the $3.10. 
and we're going to click on that and you can see right here uh, mid price is 305 and what it is really is $305 because one option contract controls 100 shares of stock so the cost for this uh, option to buy the 38 strike November 15th 34 DTE days to expiration option is $305 from here we would hit review and send and can place the trade and it will take $305 out of our uh, account you can see right here max pro profit is undefined so that shows you that as the stock price goes up you can make unlimited profits look at the curve mode right here um, if we hit analysis tab you can see right here as the stock price moves up we continue to make money if it went up to this $50 range right here in the next you know before the expiration in 34 days we would make $915 on this $3.05. So that's, uh, you know, <clears throat> times three, it's 3X. But $900, you can see right up here, PL at expiration, $900 at this strike price of $50.05. So <clears throat> that's how you make money with the long call option. Now let's talk about selling a put credit spread to supercharge your returns. This involves selling an out of the money put below the current price of the stock and in turn buying at the same time a put even below that strike price for protection. So it's defined risk. Now, why is this strategy so powerful, the put credit spread? It's because you have a high probability of profit. It's also a defined risk trade. So you are limiting your risk. and you can also place this trade every month and do it repetitively and roll if needed. So we're going to show you an example and you can see how it's done. All right, let's take a look at selling a put credit spread in DraftKings. DKNG up on the uh, platform, trade page and table mode. And then we're going to click on the November 15th, 34 days to expiration. I like to trade between 30 and 45 days to expiration. Let's open that up. We're going to put her on the right. So we're going to sell the just below at the money. The stock's trading at 38.43. Let's sell the 38 put. And for this, we collect $2.41 right here. That's deposited in our account. And as protection, we're going to buy for $22 right here, the 28 strike. So we'll collect $2.25 for placing this trade. If we go to the curve mode, we can see that as the stock price, as long as we stay above the 38, we make full profit, 225. Our max loss is the $10 width minus the 225 collected, so it's $775. But our probability of profit, POP right here is 63%. So this leverage, if we do this every month, say we didn't make the full 225, say we make $200 times 12 months, that's $2,400. And that's based on a risk of, $775 every month. So I love the uh, put credit spread. Lastly, for more advanced traders, there's the iron condor option strategy. It involves selling a put credit spread and simultaneously selling a call credit spread. So it profits from time decay and decline in volatility. And you're collecting premium over time. You do this trade monthly as well, and you can multiply your profits over time. Let's take a look at an example. Now the iron condor is a combination of the put credit spread and a call credit spread. We're selling them both. So let's open up the November 15th chain and we will sell the, let's go about the 27, uh, or actually go the 36 Delta. Actually, uh, yeah, we're going to, sell the 36 delta and buy the 26 and then at the same time let's go out here and sell the 42 and buy the 50. there's no 52 so let's do that 
we're collecting $2.47 in order to do this. Here's our profit zone in green. If we click on curve, we can see the curve mode right here. We're profitable all the way down to 33, and we're at 38 now, and all the way up to 44. Anywhere in this range between the 42 and the 36, we collect $2.47 with 100 shares controlled by the one option contract. That's $247. And uh, we just need it within the next 34 days to stay in this green trading range. Okay, let's talk about the crucial balancing act of trading options. We want to be able to maximize profits and reduce risk at the same time. The first thing that we need to do is not trade all our eggs or what is it? Uh, all our money on one option trade. We want to keep each option trade to less than, I would say, 5% of our portfolio. So if we've got a $10,000 account, I wouldn't want to risk any more than $500 on any one trade. Now, another thing that we can do to limit our risk is to utilize stop losses when we are buying options. If something's moving against us, we can take a 30, 40% stop loss, place that and not lose everything all on one trade. Now, we also want to stay diversified. So rather than put all the trades in one sector like oil, we want to be in different sectors. So maybe a something in healthcare, maybe a trade in oil, maybe a trade in a tech company or a financial company like Wells Fargo or Bank of America. So we want to be in different sectors as well. Lastly, we can utilize credit spreads. And by selling options, we have a high probability of profit. We can utilize leverage. And we are also buying a call or a put as protection since we're selling an option and buying an option. So we've got our defined risk trade and we know our max loss. Now, let's talk about one more strategy. It's called the leaps option strategy long-term equity anticipation securities. It's basically buying a deep in the money call that is out further than one year. So in doing this, the time decay does not eat you up. So, hey, I'm gonna jump into an example right here and show you what can be done. Okay guys, for the leaps option strategy, we're gonna go out on uh, DraftKings here out to the January 16th, 2026. So you can see it's 461 days to expiration. So way out past one year. And I'm going to buy the call, the 30 call right here for $13 and 80 cents. Uh, 1360 is the mid price. So $13 and 60 cents. So that's really $1,360. That's what it will cost. That's our max loss right here. And, uh, we will own the option, uh, the 30 strike call. So it's deep in the money. And if we go to the curve mode and you can see right here, we profit just like owning the stock. So it's a way to control 100 shares of stock without having to buy 100. If we had to buy 100 shares of stock, the current price that is 38.43, it would cost $3,843 to do that. We can control the same 100 shares of stock with $13.60. And I've done this very successfully over the last year. Uh, and I will show you uh, an account where we've made a tremendous amount of money in DraftKings utilizing this leaps option. And uh, we even sold a call against it. So uh, you can see uh, we profit as it goes up. If the stock price got to $65, that the profit would be $2,100. So look at that. Uh, but again, it's, th that's pretty high from where it is today. But even 55, we make $1,140. So that's uh, almost doubling our investment. So if it's 1360, we could double our investment, you know, right where we get up to around that $57 price range. And DraftKings could very well make it up to that uh, level. All right, guys, if it sounded a little bit confusing, hey, it did for me as well at first. So hang in there. 
be sure and hit like and subscribe so you're notified of future videos. Remember to download the free options workshop in the link below. Leave a comment, ask a question. What are you trading? What do you like about this video? Let me know. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one.